Hey guys, welcome back to No Catchy Name. It's me, Ella. Today is July 24th, <laughs> uh, 2023, and so it's 99 days until Halloween. I wanted to come on here real quick and just ignore my laundry. <laughs> um, show you the blanket like with me standing up holding it so you can get an idea of the size that it currently is. And then we can see how big it grows. I guess I could measure it too, but well, you know, whatever. I'm just gonna hold it up. <laughs> so like I said before, I started this in 2021 for a collaboration. And then I worked on it last year, 2022, <laughs> and then this year, so. I don't know if this is a good angle. It's probably not the best angle. Okay, so this is, it's kind of a square. So it's this long and it's also that wide. <laughs> so that wide and this long, whatever I'm trying to say. You can see the way it kind of has a ripply effect to it, but I'm not worried about that at all. Cause you know, it's just a blanket. It's not like a piece of art, you know, I'm not like, this has to be perfect, but it's already a decent size. Like we did use it last year. We put it on the couch and we did use it. <laughs> um, so yeah, I, I do want to get those ends woven in. And then here in a little bit, I will be putting some more in there. Let's see, where did I get to yesterday? Right here. So I'll be putting, putting more into that. Today, I haven't pick, got a color yet. I've just been, I usually try to randomly grab, where's the end of the row? Okay, the end of the row's there. <laughs> so um, I don't have a whole lot of scrap balls in the colors that I want to put in this blanket. I'm trying to keep the colors, you know, these bright and black <laughs> Halloweenian type colors. Um, so if, when I ran out of scrap balls, I will probably just grab random amounts out, you know, grab a, a floppy skein and attach it and use some of it and then just, you know, eyeball and cut it and do that again later, you know? Uh, yeah. And someone's mentioned that I should start putting some bones or something on it too. So I might do that this time around. I might put different appliques instead of just the spiders and the eyeballs. <laughs> So I might look for some different appliques that are kind of small or come up with my own little patterns because the spiders is my own little thing. I think I made eyeballs too. I don't remember. <laughs> I have to go back and look at my old videos. But anyways, I just wanted to show you like the size of it with me standing up. I said in the video the other day that I'm 5'8". I'm not 5'8". I'm 5'7". <laughs> I don't know why I said 5'8". But um, anyways, you know, it's basically the same thing. <laughs> so I'm going to put some yarn in this and that'll be today <laughs> but the video that I watched the movie is Pearl and it was also on Paramount Plus which is a paid subscription uh, streaming service <laughs> and it was a really good movie I had seen a lot of like clips of it on different you know like TikTok and stuff um, and I've been wanting to see it forever enough I seen that it was on there so I wanted to watch it um, it's basically <sighs> uh, it's about this girl <laughs> I know it's a prequel I haven't seen the movie that it's this like the second one <laughs> uh, and it's not anywhere to stream for free so i have to wait to rent it or um it to be put on something but it's just called x like the letter x um anyways pearl is about like this girl who lives in like it's like in i don't even know what time it is it's during world war one I, I believe i think so so it's, you know, around the turn of the century or whatever. Anyways, <laughs> she's married, but her husband's off at war. And she's just kind of like a country girl. And she lives with her mom and her dad. And they're like, her dad is disabled. And her mom's kind of overbearing a little bit. But, um, <laughs> yeah, but anyways, it's, it's kind of a gory movie. It's got some gory parts in it. But she's basically got, like, mental health issues. And she kills a lot of people. <laughs> and she ends up killing her well, I don't want to kill, give it all away, but she kills a lot of people in it, and she just has a lot of issues. But be warned, it is a gory movie, but it also has some, like, adult-ish themes in it. So, uh, if that's not your jam, don't watch it. <laughs> but I thought it was a pretty good movie. I think it was five jack-o'-lanterns out of five. <laughs> I liked it a lot. Uh, actually, the way the way this story was told, I feel sorry for her because, she, you know, she's obviously got some issues. <laughs> and, um has been neglected in that sense you know but anyways that's the movie i watched so check it out if you want to don't if you don't <laughs> but i gave it five jack lanterns out of five jack lanterns because i thought it was good and i really want to see the other movie then when it's called x but it's not available anywhere to stream so i have to watch it eventually but yeah so i'm gonna go ahead and put some yarn in this and then i'll show you it or i'll show you a clip of me putting the yarn in it or something i don't know <laughs> but anyways i'm gonna hop off here i'll see you guys in the video bye guys <laughs> 